Carver. This development proposal is causing confusion, stating that Old City Hall will be transformed into a four-story garage to accompany a 90-story condo. I'm Faiz Amin. Now, is this a joke taken too far, or is it sending a message to the city? That would be totally absurd. Many people passing by the heritage site couldn't come to grips with this notice that's been sitting on the front lawn for days. Application proposes to convert the existing heritage building into a four-story parking garage. Obnoxious, the idea. That there are so many huge con condominium towers already, and to take the old city hall, the courthouses, and turn it into a parking lot for rich people to have a condo downtown, it's, it's disgusting. So let me kind of shed some light on this, too. So it could be a joke. Seems like a joke. Well, it sure looks like a joke. It is a joke, hey? Do you think for sure it's a joke? One that isn't only limited to Old City Hall. A link at the bottom of the notice takes you to a website that features even more outrageous development projects on some of the city's most recognizable landmarks. The Blue Jays are getting some new neighbors. Well, according to Glowworm and Tuggy, the artists behind the posters. The stadium at the Rogers Center will serve as a podium for two 60-story towers. Notice that the roof will remain closed during construction. That wouldn't bother me. <laughs> and hey, what about building a condo halfway in the air, connecting to the CN Tower? Uh, the now I know it's a joke. Even Casaloma wasn't spared. Do so you think they're real? No, of course no, not. They're, 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 they're all spoofs. What do you think they're spoofing? What are they spoofing? Yeah. Planning process, planning processes. Probably. The two artists didn't explain the meaning behind this project, but they sure created a stir, leaving people to figure it out for themselves. Maybe it's a way of protesting to having so many skyscrapers in the, in the city. Toronto has been so incredibly conservative with planning stuff, so it's great to have a spoof like this. The city finally has a sense of humor. No There's more. Uh, something going on, no but more. I don't know what it is. Yeah. yeah. I don't think Mr. Tory would go for it. Now, we did reach out to the city for a comment, but did not hear back. Meanwhile, if you'd like to check out the artist development proposals, you can head to our website, citynews.ca. At Old City Hall, I'm Faiza Amin for City News.